you, the guys, everybody, you know, it was amazing. Mm. You know, it was amazing. And uh, I just to say, you know, respect, you know. You know why? Yeah, respect, you know what I'm saying? Say, yeah, kind of. Yes, sir, yeah, so respect, you know what I'm saying? Let, let's talk about a little bit about, about Kawhi. Mm. How you like playing with Kawhi? He's just a great dude. Like, I think, you know, people don't really know him um, but if you get a chance to know him. That's how I always say to people. Yeah, if you get a chance to know him, he's, he's like an awesome teammate. Like, you know, he's he's just like anybody else. Anything that's going on, like he has some type of knowledge about it. And so, you know, big shout outs to, to the board, man. I see I see you guys very close now. Like uh, so a couple of times I heard like he, he came to your house, mm -hmm. you know, you go to his house, like. Yeah, we kick it. Yeah, we kick it. Um, that's good. We kick it, you know, we, you know, we, we, we share a lot of interests. Uh, we got little kids almost the same age and so, you know, he just do daddy things. Oh, none of your teammates is very close to you. Uh, it's Reggie Jackson. You are the reason he actually signed with the Clippers mm -hmm. uh, last season. Yeah, that's my boy. That's my boy. Um, I knew he could help us. Like, I think uh, it was like a steal, you know, because people read him off. Definitely, yeah. That he was done. Um, and it was, it was far from the truth. He's got a lot of game in him. And I think he's just as good as the, the premier, you know, point guards in our league. Um, he has that type of talent. And uh, I think, you know, I think we saw it, um, you know, this playoff run. He had great, great playoffs. Uh, it's amazing to see. Mm -hmm. uh, even how young fella, teammate. Teammate, who? Yeah. He took a jump. Took a jump? Yeah. I heard a story uh, last summer you was working with him. Yeah, so when I, when I first got to the Clippers, um, you know, I had just got my shoulders operated on. Um, so they basically threw me in with the young guys to kind of get, get back on my feet and, you know, get some basketball reps. And, uh, so that was like the first time I seen T-Man up close and, uh, I didn't, I didn't know much about him, but, um, just from afar, I was like, hey, he's, he's solid. Like solid, he's got yeah. a good size. Hard worker. Hard worker. I seen yeah. him in there, you know, putting in the time. Good, good kids. He want, he want to learn. He, he want to learn. That's a good and thing it was, it him. was just awesome to, to, to you know, have that mentorship with him. No, I, I love to be his mentor because uh, he's one of the young fellas. He's like, he's really want to learn. Like, he come ask you questions. He listen to you. He just, you know, I, us as a vet, you know, yeah. it's different when you talk to young guys. Yeah. You know, who really focus, who really love the game, who really yeah. want to learn. They like, come to you. Like, listen to you. He just, he like just he's give a kid. You. Like, I'll be mad if he's not great. Yeah. And and you know, I'll be mad for him if he if he doesn't push us. Definitely. Because he's got it in. He got it. Yeah. For and sure. we we saw during the playoffs. For That's sure. amazing. Uh, how's your, your relationship with T. Lou? Uh, my relationship is good with T. Lou. You know, he, he's never came or, you know, had the connection that he, his player coach. It's, it's like, honestly, like, big bro, little bro. Big bro, yeah, it's like, bro, like, yeah, like. I feel like when I talk, when, I'm, when, I, when I, I talk with T. Lou, it's like, I don't feel like I'm talking with, the, with my coach. Right. You know, it's right. like, you know, my, my brother, like my guy. That's yeah, my like, guy. I'm gonna go yeah. to war for him. I'm gonna I'm I'm do whatever. It's so cool. Whatever it takes. Like, that's my guy. That's that, like, that connection right there, I'm gonna I'm ride with him. We're talking about, let's talk about a little bit about Banner. He's like, you know, we, we every time when we, people watch the game, uh, he's so exciting, yeah. you know, he jump on his chair and all that. You know, personally, your relationship, what kind of person is? Uh, you know what? I, I got a, a really good relationship with Steve. Um, and, and all of that antic stuff is real. Like, he's really invested in, in in us. Like, he's invested in the Clippers. Like, it's it's not for show, it's not for for memes, it's not for, like, he's genuinely, like, invested. You can say, yeah, you're right, 100%. 100%. You know, like, if you see the, the way the organization, mm -hmm. and, you know, the way the things go, mm -hmm. like, you know, the respect, mm -hmm. you know, the professionalism, everything. Like, right. I agree with you 100. Right. Yeah, you like you you would you would have thought like every game is his first game like he's ever been. To. It's always exciting. <laughs> yeah, always like right. it's yeah. like all of this is it's just new. All of it is refreshing. PG 13. Why PG 13? Right. Okay, what's the story about behind? So that? I mean, I was 24 before. Okay. Because um, of because of the late great Kobe. You know, I'm making my way, finding my way in the league. And, uh, you know, at the time I was in Indiana, so I wanted to basically, you know, put my put myself out there and build my, my name as a household name. Um, so just, you know, jokingly talking to my agent. Man, you should go by PG-13. So I was like, nah, that sounds crazy. And then literally like a couple weeks go by and I was like, you know what? You might be on to something. And so uh, that's how I went about. Playoff P. 
Mm-hmm. You heard about it, right? Yeah, yeah, I know him very well. You know him very well? <laughs> 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 you, you know Play of P. Okay, what, you can, what could you say about Play of P? Uh, I mean, they, it, they ran with it. Like, Play of P was, I was having fun. When, it, when, when Play of P was born, I was having fun with it. Like, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, I'm having fun with the, with the media. Yeah. Then, like, Play of P is supposed to be, like, Michael Jordan, apparently. But playoff P is, is 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 there for the moment, man. He uh, he enjoys the moment. Win win, lose or draw, he enjoys the moment. All right. Like for me, it's, it's it's giving everything I had. You know, like this past playoff, if I had to play every minute, I was going to. You did. I didn't care. I didn't complain. Like it was it was my job. Yeah. Um, and so I, really, that's what playoff P is doing whatever it takes. What is better, win one championship or win MVP but never win a championship? Uh, win a championship. Yeah. yeah. Why? Why is that? Cause it's, it's what you play for. Like I don't care about MVP. Like MV, like like MVP. You, it's cool because that's on the process of trying to get to where you're trying to get to. 